Hello there, YouTube here, aka Aurora Guinevere Price, back with Emma Story. So, um, last we left off, we discovered we're gonna need to find some elevator parts so we can, you know, get to visit with the elevator. And we may or may not need to go into the torture cells. There was another way back in the main hall that we could have gone, but I don't know if we're coming back here. Oh, that's right, because I need to, ah, uh, shoot, right? I guess I have the key. Yeah, so, nah, we need to go check that. That was up here. Wasn't there another way that I could go down here? Sorry, guys, I'm, I'm not going to try to take too long with this. I just want to make sure because I don't want to miss anything. Or is this where the elevator is? Okay, this is where the elevator is. So, here's the elevator, which doesn't, it's not going to work quite yet. Yes. All right. So, elevator isn't working. I should check the machine room. Right. So there's the elevator that we missed last round. So machine room. Thank God the lab was well lit. I felt strangely at ease in there, but I think my computer loads way too fast. I can't even read it. Well, it was much nicer out there. It's, don't like it in here. Alright, okay, so nothing really to see in here. Got another memento. Looks like I'll need three rods to get this elevator running. Alright, well, it just so happens we have. Oh, okay. Did you give me another memento? No. Alright, so we got that taken care of. What's in here? Okay. What are we gonna need in here? We got a hammer. I don't know what that is. Can't open that. So wait, was this where I came in from? This was where I came in from. Okay, good. <clears throat> So what is in here? Get around, make sure I don't miss anything. Shovel and coal. Well, I do not want to fall down there. Uh, I still need to look in that. You know what? We're here. We're gonna go. Climbing down the ladder, climbing down the ladder, climbing down the ladder to see the spooky spooks. Alright. So what's in here? Besides some really scary screeching music. Is there nothing down here? Really? Ah! Well, I did that. I don't know what it did. <gasps> okay! Oh! <laughs> Hi! Body parts. Nice to see you. Just dropping in! <laughs> okay, sorry. I don't know, it was kind of funny. Alright, so we got that taken care of. Ow. <sighs> Alright, so the, the, the moon was she was in new condition. Never mind. I don't think it's a fault of the actual loading screen. I think that's just my computer now loads things way too fast, so I can't read it. Whereas before, I probably would have been able to read it like 50 times over. Oh, that's right. Duh. Use the key. The rest of the key won't work in this state. Gotta find some oil to rejuvenate it. No. No. 
right, okay. Where does one find oil? Did I miss it? In the other areas? be. I mean, besides with all this stuff. to notice because typically I wasn't able to notice those things before. Okay. Excuse me. Like you guys have all that you need out of the world. Oh, hi. For having mercy on a test subject, Robert punished me by tying me upside down by the feet to a wooden rack. Two of his mindless servants proceeded to saw me in half vertically until the saw cut into my pelvis bone because I was upside down. The blood rushed to my head and it took longer for me to bleed. Oh, okay, that makes me uncomfortable. Right, okay, so you have fun with that. I'm. I'm not leaving. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Please, no. Oh, okay. Ow. Oh man. Ow. Ow. You know, it's just as sensitive for girls as it is for guys. That's all I gotta say. Ugh. Thank you, ghost, for torturing me with your pain and then giving me a crank. Drill. Am I crouched? I was crouched. Why was I crouched? Right. So I guess we're gonna go... This door? Are you gonna have some sort of spooky, spooky thing for me in here? Could you just open and let that be the end of it? Okay, I know you're you're spooky, but I need to check for items. Okay, we gotta talk about priorities here. See priorities. I take your tinder boxes and then you can torture me. Today I was. I finished creating the brazen bowl for Robert. This is certainly my masterpiece. However, when I opened it to show him, he pushed me inside, locked the hatch, and ignited the fires below. I cooked slowly, suffocating for an hour before I died. That sounds like it sucks. I'm gonna back away slowly, and you are not going. Nope, okay. You did anyway. I can laugh too. <laughs> oh, hi. Let me out. Excuse you. Can you let me off now? Nope. Uh, I wanna let me out. Not cool. Not cool, dude. Not cool. Making me go and oh no, I'm going too insane. 
too insane. Oh, thank you. I probably should be utilizing the lights more often. But I just don't want to run out of resources. Hold on a second. My phone turned off. Alright. Actually, let me check something real fast. Alright, never mind. Okay. I just had to check to make sure I actually remember to record. Because I was like, I don't know if I pressed record or not. But I did. So we're good. Okay. Door, you need to stop moving. That's just. Is somebody there? Yes. Speak up now. Yes. Hello. What's up? So your name is Emma, huh? Actually, that's my Don't sister. Anyone by that name. I bet you're looking for that elevator ride, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Please give it to me. Well, that's I'm not opening said. this door for anyone. Oh. Especially with all these weird things going on. Well, you should see the weird things I'm saying. Everything's moving. <laughs> This guy won't open up. I bet he has a key in there too. Could there be a way to compromise the lock? But I just bang on your door. Let me in. I am a normal young woman. I can provide you with children. Let me in. Okay, fine. Well, I guess this is gonna be the last one. Wait, cause I have. I can use these to. I need all three before I can combine them. Alright, so we're gonna we're gonna go through this first. Then we are going to use the drill and we are going to break into that ma Ooh, hi. We're going to break into that dude's thing. Part of my revenge! Being trapped down here offers its perks. I overheard Robert talking about some kind of guiding machine rod that is vital to the function of the elevator. I knew what I had to do. When the time was right, I managed to escape captivity for just long enough to run to the machine room and steal a rod. I have hidden it somewhere down here in my torture area. <laughs> somewhere he will at least ex somewhere he will least expect it, but it's only part of my revenge. I must have patience. Alexandre Dante. So. Right. Tell me your secrets. Never have I seen or experienced something more horrible than the Iron Maiden. Once locked inside, I had virtually no room to move. If I accidentally shuddered or twitched, one of the spikes would impale me. Not deep enough to kill me, of course, but the resulting pain would cause me to inadvertently move again, thus continuing the process until I eventually died of blood loss. That sounds pretty flippin' awful. If I just walk in here, will you do it for me so you don't have to... Or is, was that a bad move? Do I need to try to leave? There. Light. Beautiful light. So does anyone know the history behind the Iron Maiden? I read in a book that it was actually invented, not invented, but designed by Elizabeth Bathory. And like, Excuse me, I'm in the middle of telling something really cool here. But anyway, so let's pick this up. Pick it up. So, there would be like a hole at the bottom of the Iron Maiden, and it would lead to some sort of like duct system, and it would drain the blood from the girl to the bath where she would bathe in their blood. I don't know if that's actually true. I read that in a book pertaining to Dracula knowledge and history. It's still pretty cool. Just what the hell are you doing? Come again! When unlock the door. Oh, man, girl, you're so clumsy with all your tool tools. Excuse me, door. So, are you my prince charming? Like an enchanted? You look nothing like Patrick Dempsey, though. Alright, well, you have fun. I'm, I'm gonna raid your stuff. Steal your poop. It's all gonna be mine now. Hey! Is this your friend? Are you facing me now, or are you facing me the other way still? Well, here, have your friend. Mm. 
nothing in the drawers. Oh, that stinks. Who? Oh, out of my way. Okay. Robert's personal diary entry number three. Oh, number three. Do we miss number two? Might have missed number two. 15th of January, 1844. It has been over a month now since my last entry. This orb gives me more power than I ever could have imagined. Why did I ever think to use it for good? <laughs> Why? I can literally accomplish anything now. I shall increase my torturing, not for scientific reasons, but because it is so much fun watching people scream in a bag. Pathetic! I have now come up with a plan involving Emma and her suitor, Neil. She is smart, but she will never expect what I shall do. I must make the preparations. Soon I will become immortal! Robert. Alright. So it seems like Daddy's gone a wee bit bonkers. Just a wee bit. You know? Because we all know that typical dads want to take over the world, right? Here, did you, did you see your friend? Did you, did you, did you, I can, I can see it, no, okay, well, well now what? Just to make sure, I'm not missing anything, am I? Did I get anything new? I didn't get anything new. I have 19 tinder boxes. <laughs> No, that was that one place. Well... I didn't find anything, though. I mean, was there something else I was supposed to find? No, that was the hanging upside down. This was the brazen bowl. I want to check to see if there was anything inside the bowl. There are rooms down here. How do I get down there? Still have nightmares about those horrible torture cells. <sighs> so what am I missing? Ooh, there's water down there. <sighs> what am I missing? What am I missing? What am I missing? I feel like I'm missing something completely obvious. I used the key, but it's too rusty. I need to combine it with something. What do I combine it with? Is there something that I missed in the machine room? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe there was something down in that. That doesn't move. That doesn't work. <coughs> Whoa, sorry there, guys. Uh, da -da -da. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna use everything that I can. Alright, well. Let's go back down here. Maybe I missed something. Must have missed something. I undoubtedly missed something. But the 
question is, what did I miss? I don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. supposed to do I definitely know it I missed something I had to have missed something the question is where where did I miss it let's turn that off I have no idea what I missed nothing else in here. Right? Yeah, there was nothing else in here. <sighs> I don't know what else to do, guys. I don't know what else to do, and I'm over the time limit. So, I don't know. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. Hey, uh, so yeah, anyway, uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and leave it here then for now. So anyway, this has been AGPAK Aurora Guinevere Price with Amnesia and the Story, and I will see you all later. Goodbye!